morning guys welcome to today's video today is rainy and yucky outside that is not going to stop us um on weekends we switched it up a little bit and only two of us do chores on saturday and then the other two do chores on sunday and i am trading in whip girl and getting kind girl as my partner we had a competition yesterday and i lost because gabby had a whip and scared the horses and i don't want to lose anymore so i'm trading her in um anyway gabby is still in bed so you know what that means sneaking some of her chocolate for her coffee. Right, you guys, welcome to Nice Girl. Forever known as Nice Girl. You guys won, you won the competition because Gabby had a whip. So now you're my partner. So that we can win. I could see this through, I could wait. Tomorrow is Easter. Tomorrow is Easter, what do you think the Easter Bunny's gonna bring you? Uh, South heads, the meal, candy. Why do you think all that? Because. Do other people get Lemieux saddle pads for Easter? No, but we're equestrians and that's what we like. But do other equestrians get? Do all equestrians get saddle pads for Easter? Not all. But you some think, might. You think you will? Another night. One more night. One more night. I could fight it through. Till the darkness turns to light. One more night. I think it would be so cool to do like a montage at the beginning of winter this year of like all the scenery like coming down how I do like that little thing to show you guys what the weather is like and what the property looks like each morning. I think it would be fun to see it like a whole year of that fast forwarded. Hey kitty. Where were you? I didn't see you at all yesterday. Hello. Oh you're wet. I don't know where you were but you were not inside. No you weren't. This is the friendliest kitty. Say it's gonna be okay. Cause this winter is so long, feels like it's haunting me. Say there's gonna be a change. Cause I feel like I'm just holding on to yesterday. But if I wait till the summer, summer, oh, oh. If I wait till the summer, summer, Something crazy is happening and I wanted to share it with you guys before I forget because it's huge. All of us have decided that mucking stalls is so much easier now. I've been lifting this big huge of poop, bucket of poop, and before I could barely do it, now I can do it almost easily. Like, it's amazing the changes in our bodies and in our minds since having our horses home. What? Yeah, everything is so much faster. Yeah, well, because she got the easiest stall. I, oh, she put her ears back. I always feel bad for the horses because the kids are kind of crazy and loud. And well, we're going to get candy tomorrow. Yeah, so tomorrow's going to be worse. But then I have to stop myself and realize that, that the best pets are the ones that are raised by kids because they're more quiet, more calm, used to anything, and don't lose their cool when things happen because... At our old barn, you guys saw how chaotic and crazy it could be there with all the kids and all their horses, and they all had the best horses, and I think that's why, because of the craziness of the of the kids. Okay. So this is the one that we did do. So we did Stella like two days ago, and this is how she is now. Isn't yeah, she so good now? So before she would bolt when it slowly rolled to her. And yeah, Finn. We did not do him yet. Yeah, so you. He's just scared. Yeah. So see how uh, getting placed by kids is awesome. Yeah. Is it just me or does everybody jump when a horse spooks? I did. I did because I was not expecting that. But Willow's doing really good with it too. Everyone that is so
Wow, did you just teach her to back up like that? No. Oh. <laughs> what is she supposed she to do? Take her foot out of it. Oh. Just gently tapping until she gets stuck. Yay! We're headed to the barn because our lesson got canceled the other day, so we're having a lesson. And I want to show you guys one of the things that we got Kaylee for Easter. So we bought Kaylee a couple of little things for Easter. I'm excited to share with her. One of the things is this. Where we live, you can have chickens in town under certain conditions. And I think Kaylee would really love to be a part of the chicken community. So we got her. Uh oh. This tiny little chick, you guys, she's an uh, uh, Ericana. She is a little show chicken. She's gonna be a little show chicken. I want my kids to get into showing chickens once I figure out how to do it. Um, she is so cute. I checked it out with Kaylee's mom and dad, and they said that if it doesn't work out and they don't wanna keep her, she can always come back here. So that was the big reason that we got her, because she can always come with us. And I'm hoping that that happens because I'm already literally in love with this chicken. Do you love her? I need breakfast. All right, get e eating something quick. So this is our uh, our Kaylee's Easter present. And if she decides to have her and take her home with her, she'll go home with a friend so she's not all alone, obviously. The presents that we gave to you are super thoughtful presents. Like you, she gave them, my girls, like you should not have bought us presents. But anyway, we wanted to buy you a something little so that you could know how much we care about you because you're such a part of our family. You always help us with our horses. You always do fun things with us. And okay, so so this is the first one. Gabby, bring it in. Oh my God. She's a princess. Wait till you. She doesn't have a name yet. She's a, she's an Aracana, Aracana chicken, and she's a fancy special chicken. She's a show chicken, so you can take her to a show. We're going to show. She's kind of ugly when she grows out. No, she's gorgeous. She has no, long she has hair. Long. Yeah, long hair. We're gonna cut them. No, no. Wait till you see. Listen. Um, she. Your parents said you could have her. I can bring her home. Yes. I get to bring my chicken home. And we have food and water oh, and a little container she, for her. She was so lonely, so we gave her a stuffed kangaroo. She has animal. a little stuffed kangaroo and she sleeps with it. And she does cuddle up to it. Oh my god. And she talks a lot. Like she's she chirps all the time. She's totally different than our chickens. Mom loves her. I get a chicken. <laughs> Listen, there are pet chickens. Do you really do you like her? Yes. Isn't she pretty though? Like, look at how cute she is. Yeah. What are you gonna okay. Yeah, you get to pick her name and everything. Tuesday. She looks like she likes you, actually. <laughs> she looks she like a chipmunk. Climb up your arm. And yeah, and right here. If you like rub her neck and stuff, she falls asleep on you. Okay, so we're gonna show her what she's gonna look like when she's full grown. Like. <laughs> The male is kind of ugly. The oh. rooster. Oh. <laughs> this we did not get you. Somebody made that for you. The person that I bought this present. There's two presents in Payne's there. Owner. Yeah, oh. I ordered these from yeah. Payne's owner. A lady at our barn sells these, and I thought that you guys could wear them like for camping. Oh my god. So I, I didn't know. I didn't know if you would like them, but I thought at worst you could wear them they're for pajamas. So fuzzy. Are they fuzzy? Oh my god. Oh, I they're so them. soft. We're gonna get them. There's something else. Oh, they're soft. But anyways, the worst case scenario, they match your shirt perfectly. You can wear them for pajamas. And you guys can all, if you guys all oh, had them. The, it's the thing that I clued her in about. Oh, yeah. the thing you spoiled. <laughs> yeah, my kids are terrible at. There's another. There's another bracelet. So that's a bracelet. You gotta open this thing first. <clears throat> yes, okay. look at it. So. Oh, so I gave you a couple of these ones, but look it. Do you know who that is? Me and Ted. Yeah. Oh, and then so put this cute. bracelet on, then you could swap out. So Deborah gave you the bracelet. Then you could so swap cool. out these, so you just take it off. So, and put that so if you wore like you, you know a blue set or whatever, you could wear this like, and it would match or whatever. But so and then you, you have the day by day logo. That is so cute. And I got you a diamond horse. Mm -hmm. Oops. It and looks like it snaps into that and then that. Because so open this. Needs. Every girl needs some equestrian jewelry. Of course. <laughs> and some diamond hooks. So, 
so that is a um, charm bracelet and then you put whatever logo thing like you can put the picture of you and Tex in there yeah like or like whatever whatever you want to put yeah that's beautiful this is your picture is better than mine trust me there we go there we go that's so pretty. So then I'll show you how to put it on. So you squeeze it together to go over your wrist, but your wrist is so tiny it'll just probably slip on. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So it's like a little charm bracelet. Oh my God, it's so big for you. <laughs> you have to grow into it, Kaylee. <laughs> but this one will that fit That one will you. fit you. And you can put text in that one. <laughs> it's a bit heavy. <laughs> there. So it's got a bunch of equestrian things. It's got a horseshoe and a star and then a picture of Kaylee and Tex. It's upside down. <laughs> And uh, another horse. That's awesome, thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> I hope you really like your chin, yeah. <laughs> we were gonna give you a chihuahua. No, I'm just joking. Oh, no. <laughs> I don't need another one of those. You guys, whew, we just finished shooting. Um, laughing to leave the barn wins money. Apparently Gabby is a very aggressive, bad loser and cornered. If you corner Gabby, she will make you pay. You know what she said to me? I will punch you. You have to wash your hands. We all take your house. <laughs> it was horrible. Oh, best challenge ever. That'll be up on our channel right now, you guys. Go watch it if you want to see what happened down in the barn. You guys, Kaylee put her chicken to sleep. She hypnotized her chicken. Oh my God, Kelly, did you know you can hypnotize a chicken? I'll have to show you when it gets bigger. Oh, it woke up now. But look, she's rubbing his head. Look, it's falling asleep. Stomach. She's rubbing its stomach. Yeah, look. Kelly. You're like a chicken, chicken whisperer. There you go. And then when you stop. Help. So I'm, I'm screaming my <laughs> You're snuggling. No, oh I'm my gosh. Struggling. Yeah, this is what we do in the, in the day by day house we put chickens on the table yeah, where they good. poop and then we have to they eat here. Ready? ready five six seven eight <laughs> wait, 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 wait start again wait 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 start again three two one <laughs> kids gotta play you guys they just have to if that involves having to disinfect your whole entire table, then that's what it involves. Did I already say we're meeting Amberly Schneider? We're I meeting her. Know. Yeah, we're like the only YouTubers that go out into the world to meet famous people <laughs> with our hair looking like this. <laughs> but at least we washed our hands. Are you guys ready to meet your idol? Wait, yeah. I mean, to meet Amberly. Are you wait, ready? Wait. Yeah, look I, like I'm an, looking like an equestrian. I'm looking, looking like, like an a... equestrian. All right, we are in line. So do not do a challenge where you drink a lot of water before you go out someplace because now we're in line and we all have to pee. I don't. I don't. What is this? What is this? But as luck would have it, we're at the end of the line, but we get to play with all the bits. We could study bits while we wait. No, no, no. I think this is what Kaylee Oh, Kaylee, that's what kind you need. Well, let's go over there and give her a pop socket. So first person who gets a pop socket today is? Callie. Callie. Hi, Callie. How old are you? I'm 10. You're 10? Look how little you are. Holy cow. Gabby, Sophie's nine. Stand beside her, Sophie. You are so little. Anyways, you wait, have wait, a pop socket wait. for at, recognizing us. Kaylee. Yeah, Kaylee is barely bigger than you. Kaylee? Is this your brother? <laughs> Hi. Hi. Is that your brother? Yeah. Aw, that's so nice. Are you guys here excited to meet Amber Lee? Yeah. yeah us too. Sophie, for, Sophie loves her. Hi. Right, fan number two. What's your name? Lily. Lily. I love that name. And she got herself a pop socket. How old are you, Lily? Uh, 11. I have a Instagram fan account, animal under, underscore animal underscore edits underscore day by day vlogs. <gasps> so you have a fan account? That's amazing. Do I can't remember I can't remember your name specifically. Do you have edits of us? Oh uh, yes. Ah, uh, amazing. I did have... one year for Gabby. Oh, I think I did see that one. That is amazing. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> Move down. <laughs> Aw, that's so nice. I'm so glad to meet you. Thank you so much for, for making an Instagram account for us, a fan account. That's so awesome. Like, that makes my heart so happy. I'm glad we saw you here. You were shopping downstairs with the girls? Yeah. That's awesome. We're looking, yeah, we're looking for a lead line saddle. All right, we are about to meet her. Are you excited? Shy, shy. 
a little bit shy. Are you excited? She is. Sophie's like freaking out. You guys remember when when Sophie was telling you guys all about the movie, yeah. Walk Ride Rodeo? Oh, we didn't bring anything for her to sign, but I had these in my purse. I have my phone. Go. Can we give you a page? Come on. Here you go. Oh. Shy girls. Hi. Tell me your name and then we'll do these two, right? Yes, please. Tell me your name. Gabby. Gabby? How do I spell it? G-A-B-B-Y. Thank you. All right, next one. Come here. Kaylee. Kaylee. K-A-I-L-E-Y. K-A-I-L-E-Y. So do you guys do Western, English? English. English. These are hunter girls. Right. But when Sophie saw your movie, she wanted to do barrels, and then she got a little nervous when she saw how fast it was. And it, it is definitely a speed event, that is without a doubt. They all have their own horses. Hunter jumping, you you gotta look pretty. Yep. They don't make us look pretty in the barrel races. Okay. Sophie, I jumped when I was little, and then. Uh, I thought it was hard to do both English and Western. So you chose. So then I sold my jumpers and got more barrel horses. <laughs> Alright, so we got two. Alright, we're gonna do pictures, yeah. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. It was so nice to meet you. Thank you guys. We met Emberly Schneider. She is amazing. She is such a kind person. That's so cool. She asked the girls if they rode and they all said yes. She said that she did jumping when she was young and then she sold all her jumping ponies and bought barrel racers. So that was super cool. Are you happy you met her, Sophie? Yes. She was beautiful, huh? Uh-huh. Don't forget to make sure to hit that subscribe button down below.